If, if this video goes up, I got the dog. If the video don't go up, then get the I ain't get the dog. So hey guys, what a random Saturday morning and I'm about to make a bigger purchase that I just want to vlog with you guys about. It's not a car, not an apartment. I wouldn't even say it's a big girl purchase. I mean, it, it, it. I'm gonna be a fur mom, I think. I'm gonna have a fur baby. I'm gonna be a dog mom, I think. So hopefully this isn't like a scam. Hopefully I'm just um, gonna get the dog. I'm not gonna show what dog it is until I get it, if I do get it. But I just wanted to pick up my camera and vlog this because it was so, unexpected however i wanted to vlog it because if i was gonna get it any other time i wanted to vlog the process but i'm about to get myself together because of course with i want to present myself to the puppy the correct way so i'm about to get in the shower and do my hair and i'm gonna probably come back when i have myself together because i'm obviously going to get the dog with my boyfriend and probably one of his friends because i don't want to go by myself um just for safety reasons i'm gonna see you guys i'm so excited I, don't, I hope that it's what i expect the the exchange just hope i hope it's what i expect i don't know if i'm gonna get a boy or a girl but i really want a boy i don't really want a girl because i don't have time to deal with periods but girls are a lot more settled than little boys and alakai's friend just told me that he girls are easier to train than boys so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna think on it. I'm about to come back when I get ready or get myself together and I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'm at the shower and I was gonna get like really dolled up and stuff, but I'm just gonna put on this hat because the hat will make my outfit look a little decent. So I'm gonna do this hat. Let me tighten it just a bit. That's how I'm gonna do my hair. I might. This edge need to be a fleek a little bit more, so I might just, because that's the only one y'all see. So I might just put that, put my flat iron on so I can. I went outside actually for a little bit. I have a whole black, like a black leggings and a black crop top on, and I'm actually very hot. So I'm gonna probably take this off. Yeah, this is what I have on. Black crop top and black leggings. It's not gonna work for me. I'm not about to change it because, like I said, I'm not wearing this hot astronaut fit so i put on these gray biker shorts with this black crop i don't know what this is then i put on my crocs and i'm gonna bring this little fan for the little doggy because it's so hot and i don't want to be hot i hope that it's not anything i just hope it's an easy exchange i get the dog and i get out of there exchange give you the money give me the dog no further questions. Give me everything that comes with the dog. No further questions. It was nice doing business with you. Bye-bye. I -bye. obviously have to keep her number just in case I have any questions. But we're on the way to go get the puppy. Hopefully it's going to be a easy exchange. I keep saying this. So I'm at the meeting location and this girl not giving the vibes. She's not giving the vibes. She's giving me scam vibes. I called her, let me see how many times I called her. I called her six times and texted her and said, hey, I'm pulling in now, what's your ETA? Didn't text back. She texted back after I got done calling one time and said, hold up. I put a question mark and I was like, are you coming? And the bitch ain't respond yet. We gonna see. If, if this video goes up, I got the dog. If the video don't go up, then get the I ain't so it is a couple of days later and I, like I said in the last clips, if I didn't post this video, that means I didn't get the dog. But turns out I'm trying to get a different dog. So this is a very impulsive decision. It's a different dog, a different individual. This has to be a lot more official than the last B-I-T-C-H I was dealing with. So hopefully, this is a good exchange. Now, if this is if this is off, I just think multiple poos aren't for me, and I'm not gonna ever get one in my life. So yeah, I will see you guys when I'm getting the dog. I hope. 
Okay, so we are here and we're waiting again. But we're at a police station picking the dog up, so that's a plus. And we're right in front of a camera, just in case. Is that what car? Isn't he cute? Yeah, he's small as fuck too. I know, that's what I want. Stay here, y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna hold y'all in here just for one second. Oh man! Oh my god! Man, I can't see the dog. I'm trying to show you the dog. He's so small. <laughs> oh my! <God. laughs> oh my gosh! Look how small he is! Oh. Oh. I need a car, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> how small is Oh my god, he's not getting any bigger. Look at your baby. Damn it. So. <laughs> Yes, so I got my baby boy. He's actually very, 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 like way smaller than I freaking thought he'd be. Me too. Um, I thought he was gonna be big and I wouldn't like it. He's about, he's sleeping, it looks like. He's probably gonna be sleeping for the next like few weeks. couple weeks, yeah. Until he gets comfortable and active. So, I know y'all can't see me, uh, but Right now we're about to go get his, well, it's really my dog's, my mom's dog's crate, but um, Lexi doesn't do anything in crates, so she's not really gonna use it again, so we're gonna use it for Denvy. Oh, I don't know if I told you, his name is Denver Nugget. Denvy for short, Nugget for short, Nuggy for short, Denver, whatever. So yeah, she's my baby. That's she my baby. And now, and we're also gonna see if we can find him some food. And tomorrow we'll probably go get him a bed and just like the little doggy stuff because, or we could probably potentially find a bed today. Just it depends on. Um, but definitely some food he has to eat. So we're gonna get him some food while we're out. So we're at Publix trying to see if we can find the baby some food. He's in there, being my nugget, he in there. Okay, let's see. Face. You're just a model. 
his nails keep getting caught in the oil. He's such a baby. What a king. Hi. Hi. So I just wanted to give y'all more of a up close and personal my baby boy. Um, just some insights on him. Here is Denver Nugget, baby. He is nine weeks old and he is apricot. He's a boy. So I originally wanted to get the black one, but um, I originally wanted to get the black one, but because I got scammed that first time, um, I went and looked for the one I actually wanted because I really wanted this dog for years. So I'm glad I was able to get him. And like I said in the car, whatever price I paid, he was well worth it. Um, this dog is so, so rare in Georgia. So, and if you do get it, it's like from like, um, you want to get these dogs from a breeder and not a store because a lot of the time when you get them from the store, they're not treated as treated correctly. And you want to be careful with that. So, you know, he was the last one available out of his litter. And so I got him. I don't know what his parents were like. But, um, your eyes are dirty. Gotta get that clean, baby. But he is very precious. He came with a couple of shots. I have to, I'm gonna take out with me to the vet tomorrow. I mean, to PetSmart tomorrow. So I could see any other, check for any other things that he may need. Um, originally his name was Alex, but he doesn't even know Alex right now. So we're gonna keep Denver Nugget. But yeah, he's just, he is a. He's so joyful. I love him so much. I'm so in love. Um, I want him to be attached to me the way I am attached to him. So we're gonna, we're gonna get that together. He's so precious. I love him. We're gonna make him a TikTok and an Instagram. I'll probably have both of those tagged below. Um, so yeah. Here is Dini. Say hi, pumpkin pie. Hi. Let's, I want y'all to really see how small he is. So I'm just gonna put him down. Right here, he's probably like really scared. Let me see. So like that's him on my vanity desk. He's really tiny. He's really tiny. Like I didn't expect him to be this tiny. Come back, buddy. I didn't expect him to be this tiny. He is. I have to give him a couple of things tomorrow, food wise, toy wise, bed wise, and all that stuff. So we will see you guys tomorrow. Say bye bye. Say night night. Anyway, we're about to take him to the bed. But he, um, the the owner that I got him from, gave, gave him his shots at Tractor Supply. I didn't even know Tractor Supply had vets or took care of dogs like that. I didn't know that at all, but that's where we're going now. But I'm just going to get his records, and then after that, he's not going to be going there. Cause I don't know what the hell that is, and I don't know. I mean, their prices may be cheap, so I might consider it. And it's only in Douglasville, but from what I know, PetSmart is PetSmart and like Sweetwater or something where Auntie Cindy take her dog are good. So we're just gonna see. Hopefully these shots, whatever two shots he need, aren't too expensive. So we just made it to um, Tractor Supply Co. He's in my purse. Chilling. Hi. I feel so out of place. Maybe it's cheap here though. So apparently the, in the previous owner that I got the puppy from um, he didn't get a vet signature for his shots, so the baby has to go through all of them all over again. And I wanted to ask the vet if he It's tough. I hope he's not hurt. I'm gonna be real upset if they hurt him. <laughs> he's over it. Okay, so now we're about to go to Camp Creek to get a couple of things for the baby. Just go to the stores like um, TJ Maxx. 
TJ Maxx Marshalls, Petsmart, Sugar Honey Iced Tea like that. Anyway, yeah, so we're gonna see you guys. I'm gonna see you guys when, oh, I'm with my car now. Where's she going? So yeah, we're about to head there. Smart. Just went. Those are the balls. Oh, we are just spraying. Mm. No. Okay. Wipes with the spray because he be funky after um he poop and pee. I'm gonna just finish this vlog out by showing you guys the things I got for him today and like some necessities I think will be very very useful while I have this baby he's currently asleep right now right here you can't really see him but he's asleep right now but I'm just gonna show you guys the things I got for him today so <clears throat> last night he went and peed um like 10 times, I woke up 10 times. I'm talking a little low because it's late and he's literally asleep right here and I don't want to wake him up even though he's gonna wake up eventually with all his stuff moving around, but um, he woke me up so many times and it, I really lost a lot of sleep last night, but hey, got a baby, baby puppy and it comes with it. It's just like a human being, it's just a fur baby. Anyway, so it was important and last night I didn't have these because I had just got him yesterday and the stores were closing. So, I got the, I got him the um, pads, the pee, -pee pads, uh, training pads, lavender scent, premium odor, premium odor control for dogs and puppies, um, super observant, great for, great for lining crates, contains liquid activated absorber gel, built in extractant, five layers of protection and quilted pattern top. So. I got those and I'm gonna pretty much put these oops, here. I'm gonna pretty much put these in like um, two areas of my room. I'm gonna put it right outside of his crate and then in another area I found him consistently peeing at yesterday. So I got these. Um, I didn't get these from the store, but it's always good to have some Clorox wipes just in case he does pee somewhere else. I'll just clean it up with some Clorox wipes and it's lemon scented, so it really won't, you know. It really won't um, keep an odor. Also, this ball, I didn't get this ball, but this ball he's in love with. It's very big for him, but he enjoys it. I guess it's such a, it's so bright colored and it's textured, so he feels like he can bite on it. And it's actually really soft, like the little um, indents are like really soft, so he likes to bite on those. So I got, I have him, I had gotten him one of these bowls yesterday. I, yes, 
I think y'all seen it when I was at Publix. I got him one of these yesterday and I went and got another one today because I couldn't find really any good um, bowls. So I did get another one of these because he's such a small, small, small dog. So I got him that. I also got him these balls. Um, he's teething a lot and these squeak. I'm not gonna squeak them because I don't wanna wake him up. But these squeak, I got these from PetSmart. They were, no, I actually got these from, these ones from Marshalls. And they're really soft and they're just colorful and cute. And these are vibrant colors, so he's looking for them. And like I said, they're small, so he can put these in his mouth. Well, not really put them in his mouth, but he can chew on them and they'll still be comfortable for him, so. And they're playable, you know, these balls. So, I don't know where his other toy, I don't know where his other toys are. So, um, I'm really upset that I left his, um, his favorite one downstairs but these two are a part of a three pack and there's one more that's kind of just like all of this material and he loves it so got him these two toys i got him these treats got these from PetSmart because my other dog my mom's dog she she always has treats but he can't eat those because he's they're too big for him so these are just um some tasty chicken recipe bites soft moist training treats so when he does good he gets these treats and they're kind of like in heart shape shaped so yeah got those um i also got these eye wipes because he has a little the little um browning in his eyes obviously indicating that it's wet over there and i don't want I don't really want his eyes to get really dark or dirty, so I'm gonna wipe his eyes with these every single morning. And yeah, so he can be a little clean, fluffy boy. These are such a necessity because he poops and pees all the time, so I always have to freshen him up and wipe him down. So this is deodorizing wipes, vanilla bean scented, and then the spray is um, the same thing, it's just a spray. So they're both vanilla bean, they smell really good. I always want him to smell fresh because like I said, he's a little boy and he doesn't lift his um, leg up to pee right now. So when he pees, it usually stays on his hair. And when he poops, it stays on his hair because he just doesn't know better right now. So wipe him down with these and there you go. This is just a portable water. Before I got the water bowl from Publix, I could, like I said, I couldn't find a bowl that fits his size. So this is just like you pour the water in there and it just comes out. So that's gonna be good for him because he loves to drink him some water. Like he really loves to drink water. I got this from Marshall's for three dollars, I think. Yeah, three dollars. And then I just got this bin to hold all his stuff in because I want to make sure I'm keeping everything kind of in the same area. So I don't lose things. So I'm gonna just put every all of his stuff back in here. I'm gonna wipe him down before he goes to bed. Well, actually goes to bed and while he's sleeping i'm gonna kind of set up his crate so that he can go straight in there once he wakes up or once he's once i'm ready for him to go in there that's my haul this is the end of this video thank you so much for watching i happily introduce you to denver nugget i don't want to wake him up and i'm gonna wake him up just to close out the video sorry baby i'm shy oh i'm so shy say good night